Hi, in this episode of my Inkscape Beginner's Guide, I will talk about the measurement tool, which is a new feature in Inkscape. If you don't have it, go to inkscape.org and download the latest version of Inkscape. So let's go ahead and select this tool. The keyboard shortcut is M. I'm going to click and drag like this. And you can see that we have a blue line, which indicates the distance. We have a red line and uh, also another curve. Uh, and this indicates the angle. We have two labels. The green one is for the angle and the gray one is for the distance. We can also change the size of these labels by going over here. And for example, I'm going to type 20, click enter to apply, then click and drag. And you can see that now the labels are bigger. We can also change the units here from pixels to something else. Now let's see how this tool works. I'm going to click, hold down the left mouse button and drag. And I'm going to press the space key. And this will fix this to the canvas. And you can see that we have two distances here. One is from this point to this point, And you can see how much is it. And one is from this point to this point, And you can see the distance over here in this label. And you can see also the angle. Now, if you want to get a straight line, I'm going to select the tool again, click, hold down the control key, and now I'm going to get a straight line. By holding down the control key, I can also snap to increments of 15 degrees. If you can see, now it's 30, 45, 75, 90 degrees angle. If I click and drag across the text here, again, I'm going to hold hold down the space key, just click it to sort of uh, lock this tool and be able to move my mouse. And you see now that we have measured uh, many distances. This over here is the entire distance of this line. Over here we have another distance that measures from this point to this point. And we have smaller distances, each one indicated by its own label. I'm going to grab the tool again and click over here and drag and you see that we can also measure angles. This angle is 90 degrees. Uh, this tool does not have that many options and features. Something useful that you should know is that it can be used in combination with the snap controls. If you don't see uh, the snap controls over here, you can go to view, show height, make sure the snap controls bar is ticked. And also if they're uh, at some other place in Inkscape, you can go to view and change your layout to default. So let's see how we can uh, use it in combination with the snap controls. For example, if I want to snap from the middle of this uh, rectangle uh, to the middle of the triangle here, if I want to measure the distance, I can go ahead and select this option, snap center of objects, mouse over here, snap to the midpoint of this object, then go ahead and find the midpoint of this one. Again, I'm going to hold down the space key to lock this, and we can see the distance between the midpoints of these two objects. We can see also the angle. And actually, this is the distance between the midpoints of the two objects, and this is the distance between this and this point. I think this tool can be very useful in your projects. In the next beginner's guide videos, I'm going to cover more of the new features in Inkscape. So that's it for this one. I hope that it was useful. If it was, like the video, leave me a comment. If you're new to my tutorials, subscribe and visit my channel for more. That's it for now. Bye.